Hello, a very good evening to you. This is the scene here at the Lusail Stadium, just to the north of the Doha city centre. I'm Derek Ray on the commentary gantry, and sharing duties with me today, Stuart Robson. And what we have on the menu for you is this World Cup quarter-final. It's Morocco against Brazil. Well, this has the makings of a very good game. Two sides full of quality, a great atmosphere, and everything to play for. The last four places up for grabs here. And here's how Morocco will line up. Well, it'll be interesting to see how the wingers play today. Will they stay high and wide? Will they come in field and support the centre forward? And how deep will they come out of possession? They're going to be key to this formation. The starting 11 for Brazil. Alisson begins in goal. Fabinho plays with Casemiro in the centre of the pitch. And the striker is Richarlison. And the game begins. Adam Massina Yusuf N. Nesiri Amala Promising attack this And credit is due for that good piece of defending Munir Hakimi But he can't keep that effort on target. And a goal kick it'll be. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Neymar. Richarlison. Save, but still a chance. Well, they can keep possession now. Imran Lusa. A very good tackle. Who continues his run. Lusa and a chance for him on the flank and the cross goes in oh a really good header but the goalkeeper there to cover up and Nesiri oh it's got in and that will be written down as an own goal no wonder he's hanging his head. Well, as you can see, it came off him last. And as a result, it will be an own goal. So unfortunate. One nil then.
Gabriel Jesus. It's with Fabinho. Went in strongly, decisively. Now can they create something? Bufal. Munir. Real chance. And the keeper diving to thwart him. He's driven in the corner. The clearance wasn't decisive. Very quick thinking there. The bodies forward and the break looks on. Will they profit from this situation? Surely the equaliser. No shortage of excitement. Level again. No wonder they're excited. Well, here it is again, and the pace in which they break forward is devastating. It's so hard to defend against, and what a clinical finish this is. Hit with such power by Neymar, not much chance for the goalkeeper there. Great goal. So back underway following the equaliser. Well, nicely cut out. Now, what can they do with the ball? Well, there it is. Brazil have controlled the possession, but it's been a frustrating performance from them so far. They just haven't had enough guile in the final third. It's all been a bit too predictable, which has to change if they want to win this one. Well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break. Can he put them in front? Blocked it brilliantly. He'll be breathing a sigh of relief. Ball one. And the attack looks promising. Munir. Can he give them the lead? The supporters want to see him have a go. So the whistle then, we're up the halfway stage in this match. Underway then in the second half. And the two teams matching each other just about stride for stride. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Buffal. Crossed accurately towards the far post. Ah, goalkeeper's ball. Not the best of crosses, really, was it? Plenty of support here. So Brazil get the game restarted. Disappointed to have conceded. Can they come up with a quick response? Neymar. Now with Paqueta. Well, it's a good Brazil move in the making. And it's Gabriel Jesus. Well, that's a foul. And it sets up a free kick in a dangerous position.
So underway again, and it's a story of parity. Two goals apiece in this one. And into the last 30 minutes now. And he was in the right place to intercept. Gabriel Jesus. That's a very fine piece of tackling. He could pick out a teammate. Terrific block. Well, an opportunity here for them to get their noses in front from the corner. They've decided that now is the time to go to the bench. Who can they pick out? And a struggle to get it away properly. Paqueta. And there to intervene. Twenty minutes remaining. Brazil moving the ball forward. What can they do from here? Neymar. It's always likely to be the goalkeeper's ball. Amala. Plenty of support here. Hakimi. This looks more than decent. Might be able to set up the chance. There it is. And he could scarcely have had an easier finish. Well, here it is again. It's an easy finish in the end. But what was the keeper thinking? That's a poor bit of defending. Dramatic moment near the end, and that might well be the decider. On the ball in an attacking position, but they've got to do something positive quickly. Paqueta. Making progress. And caught by the keeper. Richarlison excellent assessment of the situation at the back well didn't seem to be in complete control of the ball and a corner has been awarded and they will make the change now playing it in and that's an example of how to do it dealing with a corner And space here on the flank. Well, adding up all the stoppages, we will have two extra minutes. They're showing a willingness to attack, as they must, given the circumstances. Time running out. Oh, the keeper made it look routine. It was anything but. And the final whistle is sounded. Progression is assured. They'll be taking part in the semi-finals. Well, they do deserve to go through to the next round because of their quality in attacking areas. But they must show greater desire to defend when they lose possession. Otherwise, they'll have problems in the next round. This performance in this particular game will have impressed many people, Stuart. Well, he gave them a really hard time, didn't he? His speed of thought was excellent, and he took the winning goal so well. He was brilliant today.